I knew that they said back before we left that it wouldn't hit land until Sunday. Well, to me, that's like, okay, we're leaving on Thursday. That's plenty of time to get out of town. But I didn't realize all of the stuff that went into actually evacuating a small island off the tip of Florida. <laughs> we went outside and they were boarding up all their windows next door and across the street. Um, that's when I started, I got, like, I started getting really nervous at that point because the whole, the whole island just seemed to change. It was just kind of an eerie sense when you were riding your bikes because there's no longer people, you know, laughing, having fun. People were serious. Oh, we went to Margaritaville for lunch. Yeah. And that's when I got in, like the true sense of like, we need to figure out how to get out of here because all the staff was like, yeah, we're all leaving tonight. We're, you know, evacuating at this hour. Shops were starting to close. Shops down on Duval Street were putting boards up and closing windows. And all the flights were full. There were no rental cars available. There were reports that even if we found a car, there was no gas on the island. And so we're panicking and the, the waitress, I was like, well, do you think a cab would take us all the way to like Miami? Mm -hmm. And the waitress like, oh, get an Uber. It's way cheaper. I'm like, I didn't even think about Uber on this <laughs> island. I didn't even talk to my husband at this point until we got in the car when we were driving out. And I call him and told him, you know, this is the plan. This is what we're doing. And we kind of, and I was like, well, I want to save my battery because we didn't have a charger at the time. Um, I was like, so I'm going to be turning my phone off. So then he calls us back within a couple of minutes and he's just like, well, you guys should get to Miami because I called and they have a rental car you can have. The traffic really wasn't bad. We left at the right time of day because all the locals that we talked to were going to be leaving after midnight. We were happy to be home. I think I personally got two hours of sleep in like the 36 hours. Because <laughs> I, 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 yeah, I couldn't sleep. I was needing to get home. 